Boom Boom. Hi. Okay, it's me, Jessica, and here I am making a new doll. I'm going to do some of the uh, wood grain again. I love this wood grain I got. Um, I have some more of this sort of Western fabric that I'm going to incorporate. Uh, a little bit of uh, some sort of tiki patterns. And then uh, started the arms and legs. Been starting to really enjoy using felt to make kind of more distinguished fingers and toes. All right, we'll see where it goes. Okay, thanks. Bye. <laughs> All right, here he is. He's all done. Look at that unibrow and chest hair and a little bit of green and purple hair. And of course, some teeth to eat you. Bah, 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 bah. Don't forget to like and subscribe and join us on Patreon if you like what you see. Shop link in the description below. In fact, did you know that the tea bag came about by accident? Yes. See, for a long time, I'll be the first to admit that loose tea can be um, messy. I mean, you, you get tea all over the place, you know, leftover dried tea. It's, I keep finding it in odd corners of the kitchen. Anyway, so what they used to do is they used to pack the tea into these infusers, um, also known as tea balls. I don't know why it is, but somehow you can't really talk about tea these days without sounding rude. Please consider supporting our channel by joining us at Patreon.